All right, what's going on, everyone? No, I haven't made a video in a while, but I actually have something that's kind of decent to make a video on for once. Uh, so, currently walking around. These are public trails in the middle of the city here, uh, public parks. Uh, but my car just broke down, and it's not able to be fixed today. Uh, so, rather than calling an Uber or something, I'm just going to try and make it back to the house. And... Uh, this wasn't planned. This was not something that I wanted to happen. I got a huge repair bill now, so that's great. But uh, it does give me a chance. I got, I'm not sure, I'll check when I get back to the house, but I'm imagining a five or six mile walk. And I gotta make it. I think our temperature is about five degrees right now uh, with just the shit I had in my car, had ready. So I had my main pack with me. I had this big coat with me. So uh, we're gonna see if I make it. I've actually never walked these trails before, so this is kind of cool. I get to see some things from a perspective that I never had before. And I uh, figured I'd show you where part of these trails go. These are all like public park trails, uh, but let's see if I can show you guys something that I think is pretty cool here. So part of these trails goes over some roads, and this is one of the overpasses they got. I thought that was kind of neat. I've always looked up here and I uh, wanted to know what it was like while you were standing up here. This is kind of cool. So, I don't know how much I'm going to use from my pack. I have already thrown on some of my wool socks that I had in there and uh, thought about throwing on a thermal shirt, but I didn't need it. Um, but I do have everything in here that I might need. If for some reason I got stuck out here, I got ways to make fire, I got cordage, I got cutting, I've got containers, I've got all of my five C's, everything ready to go. And my pack is not the best organized right now, but if I needed to, I would still be all right using it. Still on the trails, I think I'm about three miles in now. I've been walking for about an hour. Not sure how much further I've got to go, maybe three or four miles still I'll definitely check when I get back but we're still moving still doing good just want to point out especially after these snow and ice storms especially when you got stuff like that that's already leaning over just pay attention to what you are walking around over and what is over you something like that if it's got a couple pounds of snow and ice on it could fall at any time so far these trails have been pretty cool there's like a little frozen pond over there I got a shorts video of. And uh, we got stuff like this too that during the summertime we can go check out. I mean, you're not too far in the middle of nowhere. We got a road right over there. But still, it does not seem like a bad place to walk around in for being in the middle of a city. And uh, something like that, I'm not going to go check out today. But maybe at some point I will like drag Always Survive out here for a hike or something. We'll see. Wouldn't mind coming back. I believe the mile marker right before the overpass bridge was 1.9. And that is 2.4, so we've gone about a half a mile since then. I've been stopping to record a lot more because I'm actually on the trails, not just on the side of the road somewhere. But we've gone about half a mile in 15 minutes. So I think my rough estimate of three miles earlier would have been about right considering how much I've been stopping now. Still doing pretty good at the moment. Actually kind of warm. I got too much on for my upper body. Uh, my feet were cold for a while. I don't have actual boots on. They're just some little hikers. But now that I've been walking for a while, everything's all right. Hands are a little cold from recording though, but we're still going. About to pass the highway. Under the freeway now. We got a little stream here. It's frozen until it goes to that waterfall. Got some ducks that I think are over there now. I don't know if I'm gonna be able to get them on camera. But there was just some ducks floating around in here. Some train tracks. Overall, this has been a pretty neat walk, especially considering that I didn't even know these trails were here. Another cool little bridge here. Just past the other side of the freeway. I, uh, after spending a little bit of time under there, in the shade, I am quite cold now, especially in the hands. 
One thing I did not bring or have with me is gloves. So I've just been relying on the pockets, but especially while I'm filming, they get cold real fast. But I'm just gonna keep moving. Something that I do want to remember is that I did just find what I believe to be a cherry tree. Um, it's kind of hard to tell because everything's kind of dying off. And I'm not the best with this kind of thing. But I'm almost positive, if it'll focus, maybe, that these are cherries. Hopefully somebody can let me know that's a little bit better with this kind of thing. I tried to break one open but everything's just so frozen, it didn't really work. But I'm almost positive these are cherries. One of the things that have been really cool about this walk is there have been a lot things like that cardinal or blue jays that I've gotten to see as well so that's been another really cool thing about this I saw a couple signs that said bird preserve so I don't know if that has anything to do with it but it has been a cool thing to see got some mallards down there While I was looking at those I noticed that somebody left me some yellow snow cones so let's go. Thank you to whoever did that. I appreciate it. All right, we're exiting the trails now and going back to being close to the main roads. So I'm not sure how much more video I'm going to be doing until I get back to the house. If I do, you'll see. If not, I'll give you guys a final update once I reach the destination. All right, still alive. I'm almost back, but I'm cold and thirsty. So I got one more stop to make. a lot better unfortunately not sponsored by circle k or butterfinger all right just made it back uh, i did check my walking thing i got an app that tells me what i did and uh, it looks like it was about 4.3 miles that i did in about two hours so i was definitely going at a slower pace than i thought i was but either way i made it here made it back uh just checked the weather again we're still at five degrees outside um, so, yeah, with the stuff that was in my car on an unplanned emergency hike, four miles, five degrees, I made it back without any issues whatsoever. So, that's why it's nice to be prepared for these things. It doesn't have to be an emergency situation, SHTF, whatever you want to say. Anything simple, like your car having a flat tire like I did today and don't have anybody to come pick you up and you need to make your home safe or anything like that. It's nice to be prepared and I had whatever I needed in my car already ready to go. Hopefully you guys enjoyed and I will see you whenever I decide to post a video again.